Wait, don't skip this important declaration prayer. Stay with me till the end to manifest it. My child, my beloved child, I see your heart. I know your struggles and I understand your pain. In moments of failure, when you feel like you've fallen short of your own expectations and the expectations of others, I want you to remember this. Failure does not define you. It is simply a part of your journey, a stepping stone on the path to growth and transformation. In the book of Psalms, I have promised you this. The Lord upholds all who fall and lifts up all who are bowed down. Psalm 145 verse 14. Just as a loving parent picks up their child when they stumble and fall, I am here to lift you up when you feel like you've hit rock bottom. Your failures do not make you unworthy in my eyes. They are opportunities for you to learn to grow and to become stronger. Remember the story of Peter, my disciple who denied me three times. Despite his failure, I did not cast him aside. Instead, I gave him the chance to redeem himself. In the same way, I offer you forgiveness and grace. No matter how many times you fall, I am here to pick you up and set you back on your feet. In the book of Isaiah, I declare, so do not fear, for I am with you. Do not be dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you and help you. I will uphold you with my righteous right hand, Isaiah 41 verse 10. When you face failure, do not be afraid or discouraged. I am with you every step of the way, ready to give you the strength you need to overcome any obstacle. And in the letter to the Romans, I assure you, and we know that in all things God works for the good of those who love him, who have been called according to his purpose, Romans 8:28. Even in your moments of failure, I am working for your good. I can take your mistakes and turn them into opportunities for growth and blessing. So do not despair, my child. Your failures are not the end of the road, but merely a detour on your journey toward greatness. Trust in me, lean on me, and I will guide you through the darkness into the light. With my love and grace, you can overcome any failure and emerge stronger than ever before. My beloved child, I see your heart heavy with the weight of what you perceive as failure. But let me assure you, failure is not the end of your story. It is merely a stepping stone along the path of growth and learning. In your moments of failure, I am not disappointed in you. Instead, I am right beside you, offering my unwavering love and support. I understand your struggles and your fears, and I am here to guide you through them. Do not let failure define you or dictate your worth. You are so much more than your mistakes. Remember, even the greatest among my creations have faced failure at one point or another. It is through these experiences that they have grown stronger, wiser, and more resilient. Embrace failure as an opportunity for growth. It is through adversity that your true strength and character are revealed. Do not be afraid to fall, for it is in falling that you learn to rise again stronger than before. Know that I am with you every step of the way, cheering you on as you navigate life's challenges. Trust in my plan for you, knowing that even in the midst of failure, I am working all things together for your good. So do not despair, my child. Let go of the fear of failure and instead, embrace it as a teacher and a catalyst for growth. Remember that I am always here for you, ready to lift you up and lead you forward on the path to greatness. As you come before me in prayer, know that I hear the desires of your heart, including your fear of failure. But let me assure you, my child, that you are never alone in your struggles. I am here with you, ready to offer you strength, guidance, and grace. My cherished child, let us delve into the depths of truthfulness together. Truth is not merely a concept. It is the very essence of my being. In John 14, 6, I declared, I am the way, the truth, and the life. Embrace truth as a guiding light in your journey, for it leads to righteousness and Freedom, John 8, verse 32. Consider the significance of honesty in your interactions with others. Proverbs 12, verse 22 reminds you that the Lord detests lying lips, but he delights in people who are trustworthy. Let your words be a reflection of integrity and sincerity, for they carry the weight of my divine approval. Yet truthfulness extends beyond verbal communication. It permeates every aspect of your life, shaping your thoughts, actions, and intentions. Ephesians 4 verse 25 urges you to, Therefore each of you must put off falsehood and speak truthfully to your neighbor, for we are all members of one body. Embrace authenticity in your relationships, for it fosters trust and deepens connections. Seek truth in your quest for wisdom and understanding.
Proverbs 23 verse 23 instructs you to buy the truth and do not sell it. Wisdom, instruction and insight as well. Cultivate a hunger for knowledge grounded in truth, for it leads to enlightenment and discernment. Remember that I am the ultimate source of truth. My word revealed through scripture is a steadfast anchor in a world of uncertainty. Psalm 119 verse 160 affirms, All your words are true, all your righteous laws are eternal. Delve into my teachings with an open heart and a discerning spirit, and you will discover the profound wisdom that guides you along the path of righteousness. My beloved child, let truthfulness be the cornerstone of your existence. Embrace it with humility and reverence, for it is a reflection of my divine nature. As you journey through life, may you walk in the light of truth, knowing that I am with you every step of the way. My dear child, let us embark on a journey through the vast landscape of truthfulness. Truth is not just a principle to follow, but a way of life that aligns you with my divine purpose. In John 8 verse 32, I spoke, Then you will know the truth, and the truth will set you free. Embrace this freedom that comes from walking in truth, for it liberates your spirit and guides your path. Consider the impact of honesty in your relationships with others. Proverbs 12 verse 19 teaches, Truthful lips endure forever, but a lying tongue lasts only a moment. Uphold truthfulness in your words and actions, for it fosters trust, builds integrity and strengthens the bonds of love. Yet truthfulness extends beyond mere communication. It permeates the very fabric of your being. Ephesians 4 verse 15 urges you to speak the truth in love, emphasizing the importance of authenticity and sincerity in all your interactions. Let your character be a testament to the truth that resides within you, shining brightly for all to see. Furthermore, seek truth in your pursuit of wisdom and understanding. Proverbs 23 verse 23 advises, Buy the truth and do not sell it. Wisdom, instruction, and insight as well. Invest in the pursuit of knowledge grounded in truth, for it enriches your soul and empowers you to navigate life with clarity and purpose. Above all, remember that I am the ultimate source of truth. My word revealed through scripture is a lamp unto your feet and a light unto your path. Psalm 119 verse 105. Delve into my teachings with a humble heart and an open mind, allowing the truth to illuminate your soul and transform your life. My beloved child, let truthfulness be your guiding principle in all that you do. Embrace it with courage and conviction, knowing that it is a reflection of my divine nature within you. As you walk in truth, may you find strength, joy and fulfillment in the abundant life that I have promised you. My cherished child, let us continue to explore the profound significance of truthfulness in your life. Truth is not merely a concept to adhere to, but a powerful force that shapes your character and influences your destiny. In John 14 verse 6 I proclaimed, I am the way, the truth, and the life. Embrace this truth as a guiding principle, for it leads you towards righteousness and abundant life. Consider the impact of honesty in your relationships with others. Proverbs 12 verse 22 reminds you that the Lord detests lying lips, but he delights in people who are trustworthy. Uphold truthfulness in your words and actions, for it fosters trust, cultivates authenticity, and deepens the bonds of love and fellowship. Yet truthfulness extends beyond mere communication. It permeates the very essence of your being. Ephesians 4 verse 25 urges you to, Therefore each of you must put off falsehood and speak truthfully to your neighbor, for we are all members of one body. Let your character be a beacon of truthfulness, shining brightly in a world often clouded by deception and deceit. Furthermore, seek truth in your pursuit of wisdom and understanding. Proverbs 23 verse 23 admonishes, Buy the truth and do not sell it. Wisdom, instruction and insight as well. Invest wholeheartedly in the pursuit of knowledge grounded in truth, for it is the foundation upon which wisdom, discernment and enlightenment are built. Above all, remember that I am the ultimate source of truth. My word revealed through scripture is a timeless testament to my faithfulness and reliability. Psalm 119 verse 160. Delve into the depths of my teachings with humility and reverence, allowing the truth to permeate every aspect of your life and illuminate your path. My beloved child, let truthfulness be the cornerstone of your existence. Embrace it with sincerity and integrity, 
for it is a reflection of my divine nature within you. As you walk in truth, may you experience the fullness of my blessings and the richness of my grace, now and always. My cherished child, I speak to you now with words of reassurance and empowerment, for I see the weight of the spirit of failure trying to take hold of your heart. But fear not, for I am here to remind you of who you truly are and what you are capable of. Listen closely to my words as I affirm you against the spirit of failure. My beloved child, I want you to know that failure does not define you. You are not bound by the limitations of past mistakes or shortcomings. In my eyes, you are a precious creation, filled with infinite potential and possibility. When the spirit of failure whispers lies of doubt and defeat into your ear, remember this. I have equipped you with everything you need to overcome. You possess within you the strength, resilience and courage to rise above any challenge that comes your way. Do not allow the spirit of failure to steal your joy or rob you of your confidence. Stand firm in the knowledge that I am your ever-present help in times of trouble. With me by your side, there is nothing that can stand against you. When you feel overwhelmed by the fear of falling short or not measuring up, turn to me and find refuge in my love. I am the one who sees your true worth and potential, far beyond what you can imagine. You are not alone in your journey. I am here to guide you, to support you, and to lift you up when you stumble. Trust in my plan for your life, knowing that every setback is an opportunity for growth and refinement. Do not be discouraged by temporary setbacks or obstacles along the way. Instead, see them as opportunities for growth and learning. Each experience, whether perceived as success or failure, is shaping you into the person I have created you to be. So let go of the spirit of failure, my child, and embrace the spirit of resilience, courage and perseverance that dwells within you. You are capable of achieving great things, and I am here to walk with you every step of the way. With unwavering love and faith in you, your Heavenly Father,